Okay, today we make a, a lamb shank. And, uh, I want to marinate it first. And I want to use onion. And I want to chop it right now. And you don't need the, thai, the onion to be really small piece. It, it can be like this. And we put it right on this. Over here. And I got the garlic. I like to use a lot of garlic. I got a some small garlic, I put it like that. Yeah, I got a couple of little big, as like this. Okay, now I got a time. At the time, what I do, I take the leaves like this. At the time, it give a good taste to the lamb. Okay, we put thyme and rosemary together. Like that. You don't need the chop of this, so you want to maybe like this a little bit. I put it right over here. Okay, we chop a little carrots to put it together. And celery. Okay, I like to put this the shank over here. And I like to put salt. Pepper. I turn it the other way. The other side. Salt. Okay, now we put right over here like this. I put a little oil, not too much. Put a little wine. Give a nice turn over here. And this I'll leave a stay this because this I gotta cook tonight. I'll leave a stay for about three hours. Okay, one time it's done like this, we can cover. Okay, let's put this in the fridge there. Yeah, I gotta keep this about three hours. Okay, that's it. Okay, now this it was a stay in the refrigerator for two hours. But see, so you want you can prepare this day before, after you, day after you can do. Cause this more stay a little bit more, it, you know, and marinate it, it take a more. You know, the juice, everything, it come more good. Now, the start, I want to start the pour oil over here. Like this. Okay. I want to brown the lamb shank over here. And, and I want to pour a couple of pieces of garlic like this. And we pour this right on the, on the stove. Put the gas on. And we put right over here. Okay, now we take the lamb shank and we put it over here on the flour like this. I want to make a nice brown. Okay, there's another 
one. Okay. Gotta have a nice color now. We'll leave it stay like maybe he need like maybe seven to eight minutes maybe. And we gotta turn the other side. Okay now we give a turn. Let's just see. Oh you see? Look a nice color he got it, huh? Good. All right. Now we leave it stay a little bit more to make a nice color on the other side. Okay, now this is ready. We load down the gas. Hey, look, see a nice see one. Look at this. Two and three. Now I got this the, the saute. I got over here everything together. Okay. What I do, I want to put a little more oil over here, so you don't got too much oil. Okay. And now we leave it cook this a little bit. And, and I got over here the pots. It's the beef soup. Beef is broad, okay, I want to put it together with the lamb over here. Okay, now this I put right inside the lamb. Because this after one we eat, we eat this too. Okay, it's really good, we don't got to throw away this. Now, what I do, I put it right over here. And now, the beef broad, I got to put over here, because this you got to cook. Okay, you gotta cook so nice that the bones almost you gotta come out by itself. And this now you gotta cook for two hours. Okay, let me see. Okay, I got a little bit more broth. Uh, that's okay. That's good. Now this, I put on the gas over here for two hours on low. I cover. But see you want, okay, you don't want to check once in a while. You can put it in the oven. And you can cook in the oven. But this, I cook right over here. This is got to be nice, soft, and cook good to the lamb. Okay? Now, we put the gas on low and you gotta cook for two hours. You gotta have a good cover. That's it. And this is done. After we wait, when it's done, after two hours, we check so it's everything okay. Okay, now this is close about two hours, but I like to put a little tomato sauce. This is my homemade tomato sauce. It's cooked, this tomato sauce, a little three to four hours. And I like to put inside over here. I want to give a little extra color. Okay. And I want to give it now a little turn. Oh, you see, it's cooked. You see, it come, it come out of the bones already. All right. I'll leave a boil like maybe ten more minutes, 
I have that one to take her out. I have one strain this uh, broad. I want to make like a little grating. Okay, now we take the, the shank out. Oh boy, look at this. make a little gravy it sets everything a nice cook the carrots the celery the garlic onion everything it look good okay let me test my shank over here I like poor little rave on the top. Okay, let me try. Look at cooker, it's this. Look at that. Really good. You put all the spice in no taste no lamb, but you gotta put a lot of lot of spice like this. It's really good. Mm. It's a cook, really nice. Okay, look, it come out out of the bones. Look at this. Look. It's really nice cook this. Look at that. You know when it come out the bones like this, it's cooked good. Okay? If this tonight, what I do, nice glass of wine with this. It's really good. Now maybe she give it to me a little glass of wine, okay? I want to say chin chin to everybody. A salute. Okay. Salute to everybody. I hope somebody make this the shank like this. But he got to cook in the gravy like I did in the broad. Okay, he got to cook really good. You can make a roast with the potato you cook in the oven. But it not come nice and soft like Adil. Salute, everybody. Thank you very much, everybody, to see the look. A salute. Okay. I'm testing the biscuits really good.